So, Senator, I'll ask you before I let you go here, what calms this crowd? An arrest? Uh, the, the president spoke today. He's sending the attorney general uh, down to Ferguson. What calms the people so we don't see violence tonight? Well, let me tell you, what will calm the citizens of the 14th Senate District is one, an arrest of Darren Wilson. Also, he needs not to get paid. He's getting paid right now. He's on paid leave. If he didn't have the paid leave, they would be very happy with that. That would create calm. Next, they want an indictment, and that is very important. But we. We have to make sure that the investigation is not tampered with and there are no biases that are entered into this entire um, process. We just want to make sure everything is clean and the community sees everything for what it is. And that is the truth. We want to know what the truth is. And all of these young people that I am with every single day, Ed, I have to tell you, some of them, they're willing to die. They are amazed that they're ma they made it to 21 years old. There's a man today that I saw in the streets at the QT, and he said, I'm ready to die right now. It's amazing that I made it here. Another young man a week ago from yesterday said, I'm ready to die. You know, if Michael Brown is going to die, you know, it could have been me. And I'm ready to die right now for justice. But what my job is to redirect that energy so that we can have outcomes and action so this will never occur anymore.